looking upstream here. Again, we can see that it's pretty silty, sandy, a couple of clays. Upstream, there's definitely some more rocks. Um, probably about 6 to 12 inches on the average. Definitely some much bigger rocks um, sparingly through. Pretty dense veg vegetation. Quite a few uh, trees or bushes have been cut down. On the left side, you can see a big wall. On the right side, um, definitely not such as not as big of a wall, more of a floodplain. Don't let the water go out there. Again, lots of trees have been cut down here. You can see, just laid up on the shore. Um, riprap was installed, it looks like, at the beginning of the operation. Not too much exists under the bridge. On the left side, on the right side, however, there is still quite a bit of riprap underneath the bridge. Looking downstream, today is August 21st, 2012. Um, this is Dry Creek right here. Coming into, we believe, the Dolores River, right here. Dry Creek doesn't have any flow. It does have some standing water, but no flow. See the vegetation, pretty heavy. Definitely some scour. Right down here you can see. On both sides, this side's a little bit tougher to tell from the vegetation. It's keeping it up all right. The soil is uh, pretty silty, sandy, uh, some clays. Not too much gravel right here. Definitely you can see that there is gravel in this area.